Saturday. Yay. Okay. Pushing forward with the fake-ish. I'm just not with it today. I'm not. It's been um quite the morning. It is now. Whew. I shouldn't have did that. I shouldn't have checked. <laughs> I shouldn't have checked the time. Cause it's not where I want it to be. It's still two in the evening. I was hoping for like six. Let this day just roll on through, you know, dinner time. Boop, it's now time to go to bed, but it's not. So we're here. Don't judge me. This is my first soda in like forever. So, you know, I need it right now. It's needed. I'm going to do a little eye look today for the rest of the day because I've already been out into the world. I just wanted to do something with my eyes and see what else can I do um, with this 3305 Morphe palette. My fave, the one that I busted up and looked like it's been through Vietnam. This one. It's so pretty. Pretty, pretty. So we're going to do something with that. And maybe it'll put me in a better mood, you know? If my eyes are popping, maybe it'll put me in a better mood. So, let's get into it. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I don't know what I'm about to put on my face. What I'm about to put. What I'm about to put. You know what? Let's be bold a little bit. Let's do some champagne colors and a little dark smoky-ish going on off to the side. So we're going to go into the color Wiz in the 3305 palette, Nature palette. Force of Nature by Nature. For, I don't know. Don't get me wrong. I'll put it in the description. But I know it's the 305 palette. We're going to go into that black. I get nervous when I get into these deep colors. And we're just going to smoke our ends out. We're going to do a V shape. I already have a look. I have my 10 minute routine on my face right now. So I'm going to have to, um, dang, I'm going to have to figure that out. How I'm going to go around that because I already lined my eye. We'll just do it. Let's just do it. Let's be hood about it. So we're going to lightly tap that black on there because you see it is like real off back. So I'm going to take the excess and put it on this eye because I don't want to continue to put all that there. You know, let's just get that over here and let it sit there and chill and marinate for a little bit. Now we're going to, you know, sort of kind of blend it inward, but not completely and blending it into my crease. Blending it upward and over. Natalia, don't come in here with that. Okay, now that we have that base set for our bottom layer, we're going to go into the middle of our eyes and brighten it up. And that's my go-to. That's my go-to. And um, that's what we're going to do. So we're going to use some gold. We're really just going to push it out there and pop it out. So... The goldest and shimmery color we have on here is, hey, 
is the color pure and we're gonna put that on the middle of our lid there we don't need your ad libs hey Yes, I have. Can just work with these two colors here get out get out hmm I feel like we can just work with these two colors here and um, blend it out so what I did was I did pack the color on to the middle of my lid and then brought down the excess that was on the brush down to the front, but I did not go over the crease, if that makes any sense. So let me rewind it back. I pat it down the color in the center of the crease to give it a high concentration, a high gloss look. And then I just brought down ever so gently down to the front, being careful not to stay over that crease. So I just brought it down. Easy enough, right? Two colors. So what we're going to do now is we're going to take away that harsh line between the two colors by going back to our first brush, which was the first fluffy little blending brush by Morphe we have. And it still has, keep in mind, it still has that color of the Wiz in black on here. So be careful not to go overboard with the swiping because then your black is going to overpower your gold. So we don't want to do that. <sighs> Let's see what we got here. And you do want to go over the crease gold because it's kind of like framing that look. Get it? Yeah. I think I want to take that gold back some, so I'm going to switch out brushes, go back to what I put the pure, whatever brush you use, the, I use the flat brush, and pick up some more of the pure, and go in and um, I, I just want it further back, I do want that further back. I want that to be the more dominant color over. You see how this is more dominant going in and this one is more black coming inward. I feel like when it's lighter going out and then darkening, it elongates the eye versus making it shorter with the, the darker dominant color. You know, I don't know how to explain it. Hopefully you understand me. I pray you understand me. It's back. No. Why are you back? Go. Go. Yeah. You're back. Pretty. Yeah. Okay, so once you have it blended to your liking, 
Some people like that harsh um, demar demarcation. Me, I like a smooth transition. I like it to blend, 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 blend into it. So, once you get it to your liking, you're done with the shadows. Now, here's an extra step. You can or you don't have to participate in this part. I like to add glitter to these looks. Even though we have that high, shiny color of pure on there, I like to add more. So what I'm going to do is find where is my glitter base. I use a NYX glitter base to base the inner part of my eye here and then I pat on a loose glitter pigment. So let me find that and we'll get, hold on, just one second. Hold it. Okay, she reloaded. All right, so this is the NYX. Let's see, it is the glitter primer and I use a handy dandy Q-tip from your local drugstore wherever you get your q-tips from a little bit goes a long way i actually put too much on there so i'm gonna dab it on the back of my hand like so and smooth it out what is it with everyone today What was that? That was my frustration. Yeet! Yeet! All right. So we're gonna go into the inner eye. And we're gonna go right where the gold is. We're not gonna go all crazy. We're not gonna get like loose with it. I'm just making a small little something across where the pier is. We're just going right over the top of that color. Now I'm going to take the other end because we have to act quickly with this base because it will dry on you. I did not show you this. I'm going to show you in a second. Let me just get this glitter on my face because I'm working backwards today because I'm all out of whack. Lightly tap it on there. Don't pack it all in one area because you will have a glob of glitter on your face and then you'll be looking like a glitter ice. Like, you'll be looking stupid. stupid because I got it all in one area. I did the exact same thing that I told you I'm not to. Now I gotta spread it out. Oh, I hate moving this glitter. It's impossible to move it once you put it in place. Ah, what are you want? Pause, you guys. Because nobody wants me to film this freaking video. Where were we? Glitter face. Yes. You know what? This actually works for me. I think I'm cool with it. What you think? Because once we put them lashes on, it doesn't, it's not going to matter. It's going to be covered up. Okay, let me show you the um, glitter that I'm using, which is also, I'm out of breath. Which is also NYX Glitter Brilliance. Can you see it? Can you see it? No? I don't think you can see it. Well, this is in a GLI08. The, the name for it is just rubbed off, so. GLI08 is what you're going to be looking for if you want this gold color. Pretty pretty. Alright, um, let's do the other eye. That's dried on the back of my hand, so we need a little bit more. Whew. Jeez. Life. How did I get lost? Like that note. <laughs> and the same thing on this side. Just a little corner. Just a little tap in on the corner. Spread it out evenly. 
get that lower line. Go back in with your glitter. Pick a little some some up. Spread it on quick. I feel it. You feeling it? Cause I feel it. Mm-hmm. I'm feeling that. Bring some of that over here. Oh yeah. Okay, let's put this glitter up before we get too glitter happy. <laughs> Not we. I know I get too glitter happy. I have glitter all over my face like, yeah. Sparkling. Okay, let's get some of this um fallout off your face. You can just use your uh, foundation brush or whatever little brush you have to clean up with. Now we got to smoke out that bottom lash. We're not going to go in with the pure because we already taken care of that with the glitter. So we're just going to smoke out the bottom lash. And sure, you can go in with the pure on the outer, outer points of your eye. But it kind of gives it that reverse effect that I don't too much care for. That's just my personal preference. You can do what you do. You make it work for you, boo. So... I don't know why I got all happy and put this away like I was done with it. <laughs> Just smoke that guy out. Just smoke it out. Just oof. smoked. Smoked. Mm -hmm. You know, she always make that face when you pull your face down and think you're doing something. Mm. You ain't doing nothing. You ain't doing nothing, but yet we always do it. It's like a habit. It's all, let me see. Let me try not to do it. I don't feel right. Okay. So, as you can see, that simple eye look looks like you took forever and a day doing. And all it took was five freaking minutes outside of my husband calling, outside of my child doing the most, outside of life. You only need like five minutes. So if you don't have any real distractions going on, you can knock it out in no time and have a real deal eye look. Do we want to put some lashes on? Just to make it pull all the way together? Let's put some lashes on. Hold on. Okay, now she back. <laughs> yes, lashes, lashes. I'm feeling the look, and my nails match. Yes. So this is your finished little look, little extravagance in no time. Look, is my lash dry? Don't you come off. Don't you hate that? Like you, you think you have your lash all the way together and it just... <laughs> you thought. <laughs> oh, she on there. She on there. My eye just a little juicy. So, yeah. The, I, I'm, I'm glad that I decided to play in makeup and let you guys experience a little bit of what be going on in my life and what Natalia does while I'm doing my makeup. I like. I hope you like. Bye-bye.